Good morning, Calvary. Pastor Chad here with your word for the day. It's Christmas season. I hope you're ready to celebrate the birth of our Savior. By the way, uh, here at Calvary, we've got special Christmas services planned on Christmas Eve. That's Saturday, uh, December 24th, for those of you who aren't paying attention. Uh, we have four worship services in Havasu. We have a 1 p.m., 1 o'clock in the afternoon, classic service at McCulloch Campus. And then at Sweetwater, we have three services, one at 2 o'clock, one at 3.30, and one at 5 o'clock. So four services to choose from, two different styles in Havasu. We also have a uh, Christmas Eve service in Parker. And just for the record, no live services at our campuses on Sunday. We'll be streaming our services, but there won't be anything live on Christmas morning. So I hope you can join us for Christmas, one of the services, uh, whether in person or online, and I hope you will invite some of your friends and your family to join us as well. So it's Christmas season. We're celebrating the birth of the Saviors, and one of the glorious things about the birth of Jesus is the Incarnation. Uh, incarnation means that we get to see God in the flesh. That's who Jesus is. He is God in the flesh. So John 14, verse 9, Jesus says, If you've seen me, you have seen the Father. Now, that was after a conversation that included him talking about preparing a place for us in heaven, telling the disciples that he is the way, the truth, and the life. And then Philip says, show us the Father. Show us the Father. We want to see the Father. And Jesus says, if you've seen me, you've seen God. And so if you want to know what God is like, look at Jesus. Look at Jesus. Read the Gospels. See how Jesus responded to people. See how Jesus dismantled religion. See how Jesus demonstrates compassion and pours out mercy on everyone. Read the Gospels and see Jesus. And, and if you want to know about Jesus, then read the letters that come after that. And hear how the apostles describe who Jesus is and what he did and what his life meant for us. It's in them that we discover that he was the sacrifice for our sins. The atoning sacrifice for you and I. And he came into this world to reconcile us to God and, and make peace between us and God so that we could become children of God and ambassadors for Christ. So learn about Jesus. And then if you want a relationship with God, it's only through Jesus. Jesus said, I am the way. I am the truth. I am the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Which is why this Christmas season, it's so important for us to take advantage of the, the openness that people have to being invited to church, to being invited to special services. Look, we want you to bring your friends with you. We want you to bring your families with, us, with you. We want you to watch us online because we're going to share the gospel. We're going to talk about who Jesus is and how he can change lives. And we're going to invite your friends and your family to decide to follow Jesus just like you're following Jesus. So let's partner together, let's tell the good news, and let's celebrate the birth of Jesus. Because if you've seen Jesus, you've seen God. I hope that helps, and I'm praying you have a great day and a Merry Christmas.